Welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Psalms 29 verse 11. The Lord gives his strength to his people. The Lord blesses his people with peace. Have you been looking for his strength? Well, God can give you strength to overcome all the burdens that you're carrying. Often, friends, we find ourselves so weak, so helpless. But we are taught today that God gives us his strength. In fact, it's fear that can cause us to be weak. Yes, it can affect even our strength if we allow fear to overcome us. And that's the reason why God, uh, through the prophet Isaiah, had said, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am with God. I will strengthen you. See? He said, don't be weak. You know, don't fear. Be strong. Because it's him that will give, his, give us his strength. So he said, that I will strengthen you. And I will help you. I will uphold you with my victorious right hand. So friends, that should be an encouragement to those that are weak. That God can give us the strength that we need to overcome our problems, our challenges. Well, friends, these are too much for us to, to carry many times. But if the Lord is with us, yes, we can overcome. And, in, and then he also said that I will give you peace. If you need peace, I will give you peace. <laughs> Hallelujah. Well, you know what Jesus said? Peace I give unto you, not as the world gives. Friends, this is the peace that the Lord will give us, the peace that passes all understanding. It is not just uh, like uh, as we've been saying all along, friends, peace is not just the absence of enemies. No, peace is within us. <laughs> it's the serenity within us where we just feel peace, that peace that, again, we cannot explain. It passes all understanding. Well, this is from God. Nobody else can give you that peace. Well, friends, even if people try to give you what uh, to give you peace, what can they give? Say, peace be with you. Is it the, the only thing that you need? People say to you, peace be with you. But how about you settling your problem within, so that you can have a good night rest? Only the Lord can give you that peace and rest. And again, that's the reason why Jesus said. Come unto me, you who are weary and are heavily laden, and I give you rest. Well, friends, very encouraging word that uh, the Lord is giving us today. That he alone can give us peace that will allow us to have rest at night. Amen. We are not restless, friends, when we have the Lord with us. We are so confident that no harm will befall us. In fact, that fear of harm coming gives us restlessness at night. What will happen to me? Uh, what will the future uh, hold for me? Those are the questions that often would, uh, would occupy our mind and gives us restlessness. But today, have the peace of the Lord. And be strong in the Lord because He alone can give you that strength. Hallelujah. So friends, this is the day that the Lord had made. Rejoice, friends. Rejoice. Knowing that you have the strength that you need to survive a day, another day, and you get the peace that will allow you to enjoy your day. Hallelujah. So may the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you and lift up His countenance on you and give you His shalom. Hallelujah. God bless friends. See you again next time. Bye.